In the realm of modern military aviation, two formidable fighters have emerged, the French Rafale and the Russian Su-57. These technologically advanced aircraft represent the pinnacle of their respective region's aerospace capabilities. Today, we'll delve into the world of these fighters and compare their strengths and weaknesses. The Rafale. The Rafale is a twin-engine, multi-role combat aircraft developed by Dassault Aviation. It's known for its agility and versatility. Agility. The Rafale is considered one of the most agile fighters in the world, making it difficult for opponents to target. Versatility. The Rafale can perform a variety of roles, including air superiority, strike, and nuclear deterrence. Technology. The Rafale is equipped with advanced avionics, sensors, and weapon systems. The Su-57. The Su-57 is a fifth-generation stealth fighter developed by Russia. It's designed to be highly versatile and capable of performing a wide range of missions. Stealth. The Su-57 is known for its advanced stealth technology, making it difficult to detect by radar. Maneuverability. The Su-57 is renowned for its exceptional maneuverability, allowing it to outmaneuver opponents. Technology. The Su-57 is equipped with advanced avionics, sensors, and weapon systems. Comparison. While both the Rafale and Su-57 are impressive fighters, there are significant differences between them. Stealth. The Su-57 is more stealthy than the Rafale. Maneuverability. Both aircraft are highly maneuverable, but the Su-57 may have a slight edge. Technology. Both aircraft are equipped with advanced technology, but the Rafale is generally considered to be more technologically mature. As technology continues to advance, we can expect to see even more impressive fighters emerge in the future. The Rafale and Su-57 represent the current state of the art, but they may soon be surpassed by newer designs. The Rafale and Su-57 are two of the most advanced fighters in the world. These aircraft represent the pinnacle of their respective region's aerospace capabilities. As technology continues to evolve, it will be interesting to see how these fighters and their successors shape the future of aerial warfare. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.